Good morning. It's Margaret Fetty at the University of Sewing, and it's Facebook Live, guys. Um, <laughs> I've got quite the treat for you two today, so check this little sign out. We are going to give our customers $10 towards gas if you want to come this weekend, today and tomorrow, and try out any machine you've been thinking about. Now, this is a Dave idea. This is definitely not a Margaret idea, but it's a cute idea. So what he wants to do is for you, no matter where you're traveling from, if you want to come in and we'll demo a machine for you, you're going to get $10 towards your gas. Not such a bad deal, but this only goes for the first 10 people. So you better figure out your weekend and make us part of it. So well, 10 people today and 10 people tomorrow. Oh, you didn't tell me that. Okay. <laughs> this is so. All right. Our giveaway today is in the theme of traveling and doing things outside and being part of the wonderful ending of summer. I've got a little koozie for you guys. Now, you know, some people might put an adult beverage, but this works perfectly fine for a can of Coke. So I just want to point that out. So we're going to give away this cute little cozy today. So please share our videos. And when you share it with your friends and family, then they get to know about us. Last week, guys, you got us up to 21 people. Thank you so much. So if we can do that again, I'd be really thrilled. So thinking about traveling, thinking about stuff that we should talk about. So did you realize we still have some of these beautiful 475 CAFE machines? Did you know they come with their own case? So if you have travel in your, I mean, who doesn't have to do some traveling? You probably have grandchildren that are on the other side of the hemisphere like I do, or you have somebody that you want to go see and you're going to go on maybe a retreat or something like that. This setup right here is perfect for you to go on those traveling events. So I know you may have like a 770 or maybe you don't have a Bernina yet. What's wrong with you? We need to get you in a Bernina. You will be so happy. This little guy cuts your threads. It has a start stop button up here. It also has your needle up and down pattern begin and end. It will do all the fun things and it has a jumbo bobbin guys. Jumbo bobbin is fabulous. And instead of weighing, oh, what? I believe the uh, 770s weigh about 40 pounds. Not quite 40 pounds. I think they're 39 and some change. This guy only weighs 20. So we can carry this one around. Or at least we can get off a table in the bag. And then the bag will trustily bring it wherever we need to. And I'm going to tell you, having owned a number of travel bags for my sewing machines over the years... Bernina makes a really good quality one. This thing is tough. And so you are going to be able to have it for a long time and be able to take it with you. Even if you upgrade your machine at some point in time, you can keep your little travel bag and have it ready to go for you. I also want to remind you, we carry the 335s. And the 335 is only 17 and a half pounds. So... If you don't really want to go into a 475, which I don't understand why you wouldn't want to go for a 475 right now. They are on sale. Oh, excuse me. No, it's the 480 that's on sale, not the 475. But come and talk to me, and I'll bet you I can do something for you on a price on a 475, especially if you're not using a Bernita credit card. I can do a much better price then. So go ahead and think about that. I think it's a really good deal for you. Uh, the 335, we also have some classroom editions of these. So that would get you in for a less expensive price and you'd be able to go ahead and have a Bernina that you could travel with very easily. I mean, you know, when you go to your camp or you go to the up in, you know, if you're lucky enough to have a cabin somewhere, things like that, you want a machine that's going to be a tough machine because you're traveling with it, but you also want it to have all the features you've gotten used to with your Berninas. So a 335 or especially a 475 are pretty special. We have the traveling cases for both of these and they are available here. Remember, whenever you purchase a sewing machine, you always get 20% off of your 
accessory items that you want to buy. So that would be a good time to go ahead and buy this really wonderful case. And what else do you get? Our lessons. You get lessons with us. Yes, you always get lessons and you always get us. <laughs> we try really hard to make sure that you get all the help you need in being able to figure out your machine and be able to get it working for you and doing the projects you want. Now, I want to remind you that we just have put a ton of classes online. Um, no, they're not virtual. Most of them at least are not virtual. Some of our embroidery stuff can be virtual. For example, our software inspirations class, you can do that virtually. And so if you want to be part of that, you just need to contact us and we'll get you taken care of. But um, these classes are going to run the gamut. We're doing a whole bunch of entry-level garment classes, but we're also going to have a coat class this fall. That's going to be in October. We are going to have a fusible applique class. You guys have been asking me about applique for a long time. This one is a great entry into applique because it's all very straightforward and um, it's not a real long class. You're just going to make a little sampler in the class, but it's going to get you going and learning how to do. And we're going to go like over a couple of different ways to do fusible applique. So we have some great things to just share with you on that. The end of September, we're doing a shop hop. So it is called the Run Run Rudolph Shop Hop. And this one's really fun because you're going to get a cute little reindeer charm. There's eight shops involved. It's only over three days instead of four. There isn't a quilt in this one. What you do in this one is you can pick up some really beautiful kits from each one of the shops. They're going to be a Christmas theme. And you know what? Ours is going to be themed. We've done an apron version of that. So we have some really cute ones, a fast project for you to make for gifts. And that's going to be coming up uh, the last three days in September. How cool is that? Okay, so Dave, we're going to come back over to our lovely... Why didn't you mention that just for a second? Oh, okay. So we are hoping to have the kits ready for this later today. But we have this beautiful Bernina fabric and we're going to do a really cute class it's got some embroidery in it it's got just some simple piecing and then you are going to have a wonderful lap throw done with your favorite sewing machine brand right on it so i will i should have had the paper for that dave when we decided to, to talk about that so i will show everybody that but it's actually if you put in the bernina fleece um, you will, if you put in the word fleece, we've only got, I think, six fleeces in the shop. So that shows, it'll show the Bernina fleece on there. And the second picture on the Bernina fleece shows you a picture of the lab quilt. So I'm hoping we'll have some kits ready for that later on today. So keep an eye out for that. I'll show it off tomorrow too. So let's go ahead and, um, we'll talk about that. And... Then I want to make sure that everybody knows these classes are so, there's so many of them and so much fun to do. Um, we've got a beginning quilting class. This is really going to be fun and special. It's going to go over eight weeks. It's in the um, evenings. So you are set and ready to go. And you, we've got this already, guys. It is a really fun class. You are going to learn how to quilt by machine. You're going to learn how to do rotary cutting. You're going to learn how to do some block assembly, putting on borders and bindings. All these things, you know, sometimes what happens a lot of times with people learning how to do their first quilt projects, they don't really learn about borders and blocks. They only learn a little bit about rotary cutting, if maybe not any at all. And then the other thing they really don't cover when you first get to go, they don't cover anything by quilting it. So this is going to be a great experience for you, especially if you're a fairly new quilter. And we've got a lot of you who just started during COVID. So this is going to be something that really is special. You will be able to get a lot more information. You'll have plenty of time to work on it. It'll be a really fun class.
you're getting a lot of crossover too. There are people who only quilt that are starting to make garments. Yes, and then we you've are. got garment sewers who are starting to do quilts. It's really fun, guys. Um, you know the thing that's such a wonderful uh, experience about sewing, in my opinion, is that um, you get an opportunity to do so many different things with it there there's always something new to learn no matter how far along you are in your sewing process i am been so i i've been sewing i mean all my adult life i've been doing hand sewing since i was a child in my uh, teens i was taught how to do embroidery by my aunt when i was like 10 12 years old and that was hand embroidery and that's really all i did until i was about 21. And then I learned how to use a sewing machine. So, and then, you know, I, it was just crazy. I just went a little bit nuts with that. It's, it's obviously been my very, very, uh, you know, it's my passion. It's the thing that I want to do every single day. I mean, this morning before we're getting ready to come here and talk to you guys, this, I'm over looking through patterns and different clothes I'm going to make. And I've got all these different ideas for samples I want to do for the shop, but also things that I, one of the things I was thinking about before I left, and I'll have to show you this process as I go through it, but I'm thinking I would like to make myself a jacket and I want to put embroidery on it. And I was also thinking I have this really cute knit top that I make myself. It's not, uh, it's a Pamela Leggett pattern. And what I, what I tend to do, this top I made, and it is, um, this one's a rayon, but I also have a version of this kind of top in a knit. And I was thinking, I'll bet we can do embroidery on knit. Can't we do embroidery on knit? Now, now you guys know I'm not a good embroiderer because I'm just learning about it. But now we have this amazing 790 Pro, which I'm gonna show you in a minute. And I think I can embroider down the front of this top I'm not gonna try to do anything real extravagant with it, but I'm gonna put some embroidery down this top and I'm gonna show you what I do with it. I'm really excited. Okay, fusible applique. Fusible applique is so fun. You can do it where the stitching is visible, but you don't have to. So I'm gonna show you how to do it where the stitching's kind of invisible. Although I will just tell you, if you use a really good matching thread, a lot of times it doesn't show up really well so you can do it that way too so we're going to talk about blanket stitches zigzags we're going to talk about clear thread not using clear thread um, and we're going to do some samples and get you guys going so that you know how to do this all of the supplies are included you're not going to have to bring anything except for your sewing machine and please make sure it's in good working order so we don't have to spend any time fussing with your machine so i'm that's another class we're doing. That's going to be in mid-September. I can't wait to do it with you. And that one's I'm teaching. So, okay. So I want to point out this amazing jacket. And I'm going to come over here. And, okay, it's being difficult. I should have got you ready before we started this. Although I think it always sets back to the eco mode. Okay. Here's the Yaya Han machine. Now, did you know that when you register this machine, you can start des de downloading designs? And you see this right here, this flash drive? This is where we can put designs in right here and we can go and get those. And if we come back up to the screen here, see where that little flash drive is? So when I click on the flash drive, it is going to show designs because those are on the flash drive okay so now if I want to switch back to the sewing machine these are the designs that are on the sewing machine so you can click on there and you can open file folders and there's all kinds of designs in here so for example there's a design that we can look at this is so advanced for the price point for everything you get with this machine it is truly, truly wonderful. You are gonna get full embroidery capabilities, including using 
your flash drive to be able to add more designs. You're gonna get creator software so you can design your own designs. And you know, after you get creator, there's always ability to upgrade to V9 software if you fall in love with that. So I want you to know that. We do classes on the V9 software all the time. And we're gonna also start offering just creator software too. So that's gonna be available to you. We also, so it comes with embroidery. It also is a regular sewing machine. And you are gonna get these three different hoops. The biggest one, which I think is really big. This is a really nice big, and you know what's really cool about these hoops? I didn't realize this until recently, but they have a clamp on them. So getting your fabric in and out of this is gonna be super easy. You're not gonna have to worry about like screwing stuff in really tight and things like that. This has just got this wonderful little release and then you are set and ready to go. So also available for the uh, Burnett 79s that offer embroidery, you can use magnetic hoops. So that's gonna be really nice. So this whole package deal here is available right now. And um, I believe it's just a little over $2,800. It's pretty amazing for that and price And if we're point. worried about weight for a travel machine, this would work too. This would work great for a tra travel machine. So I have got all of the information about the Yaya Han machine. We've got this wonderful brochure. Now, what if you don't live in Bloomington? It doesn't matter. I can ship this anywhere. So if this is the machine you're thinking you'd really like to have, this is available for you. I can sell it to you and ship it to you wherever you are. This is a fantastic deal. It's coming with all these different things. You get a whole embroidery package. You get creator software. It is just a really, really nice and extra designs. Once you register your machine, you get a lot of extra designs. We're gonna cover about the embroidery on this more. I'm gonna try to do something for you every week so that you can see all the different things that is got it available. I want you to know that this embroidery right here on the back of this jacket, Dave did this on the 79, the B79, that Yaya Han edition. This was sewn on there. Look at how beautiful the lettering is. He got it in there nice and even and neat. I'm so proud of him. He did that. So he, we are going to do a video on how you would go about doing something like this. It's a really pretty, um, the lettering on this is really well done. I mean, they're just really good. You know and why I did it? Why did you do it? So that you knew we needed to go to the lake more often. Oh, that's why you did it. <laughs> He's a humor. <laughs> He's got his humor going on here today. But, you know, this is such a great price point and such a good entry level into embroidery that you will not get anywhere else. It really is fun. Oh, he, I forgot. Look at this, too. Is this one from the... from? No, this is off in the 700. Okay, so this design is on the 700 Bernina, and Dave did this from there. So that design is on there, but isn't that just gorgeous? And so we're going to do a video and show you how all of that embroidery works so that I'm going to take it from... I'm gonna put the fabric and the stabilizer in the hoop. I'm gonna go over the machine. I'm gonna show you how I just go ahead and press the different buttons to tell it what hoop I've got, which foot I've got on the machine. We're gonna walk you through the whole thing because I think that it is a little intimidating sometimes. You think you're not gonna understand it. This one's simple, guys, and you can use it. So. This is a great way to get into embroidery and decide where you want to go with it. You can do a lot of wonderful designs with it. It comes with a lot of wonderful designs, even some really cool quilting ones. So I can't wait to show you all Hey, that. Margaret, Connie just asked, Dave, do you take boat trade in for a machine? To Connie, we should talk. Do not encourage him on this boat thing, guys. He already owns, how many do we have now still? No, we sold one, we so sold, we only have two. We only have two now, but one doesn't doesn't run and one does. So he needs to get rid of one of those. Which one do you think we should get rid of, guys? <laughs> so, 
my husband the boat lover so he he would um if he had the space available it's probably good we don't have a big yard because we probably have more than that <laughs> so all right so i want to bring you back over to the 790 pro i have to finish the show up with this because did you know that this goes even faster than the high speed smart drive technology that we came out with a year ago or was that two years ago i can't remember they came out with the high speed and they updated everything so that the machines could move faster and smoother well this one goes even faster they say 33 percent 33 percent and um i'm not going to show you that today because i didn't thread the needle here so we aren't going to do that part of it but i do want to show you some really wonderful features that i'm not sure i've covered before and so we're gonna go we're in the embroidery part you see it's set up for embroidery and i want to go to the lettering because this to me is one of the most fun parts of the new things that the 790 pro can do for starters i have a traditional keyboard instead of you know how the keyboards have been if you've ever seen a 790 plus or you've got a 700 or you have a 570 or whatever usually it'll go a b c across there and it's like oh you try to figure out what you're doing it's very confusing those of us who are used to a typewriter keyboard, which now is everybody, because we're on a computer all the time, this will be much easier to use from that perspective. We have both all the different cases of letters, which I think has always been true, but I just want to point out that you can do that. So, for example, if what I wanted to do was write Margaret, and then I go back to my small letters, I can do that. And... There we go, we have my name, and then I can hit the return here. Now I've got a second line. I can go up to five lines of sewing. So I'm gonna write Margaret loves to sew, because I do. Oh, no, I love to see too, that's awesome. Uh, there, I'm gonna go with that one, guys. I like to see also, okay. And then we can put, I don't know, let's go back here for a second and see if there's anything fun we can put on here. So I'm not seeing anything that's really inspiring me. I want like a star or something. Do we have any stars? I'm not seeing a star. We can put a pound sign there just so that you can see what the mark will look like. I know there's some other things we could probably do. Unfortunately, I, I'm, Remember I told you, I'm just learning this stuff. So you gotta be patient with me. Okay, so this instead could say, grandma made this quilt for Susie. You know, so think about this from the perspective of a quilt label. It has gotten so much easier, guys. Now I can come down to my ABCs. I can center everything. I can go ahead and I can move these letters further away or closer together. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move everything a little closer together, can make that compact. Now I'm just gonna tell you, if I decide at this moment that I don't want that pound sign, I only have two options. I can only go ahead and decide not to sew it, which I could do. I could decide not to sew it. I could stop the machine before it gets to that part. Or I just have to come back over here, go back into my letters, and I have to start over again. But, you know, I'm going to just tell you that's not such a bad thing because then I could say, you know, something else here if I wanted to. And I've got Margaret and then Loves. and I could put that and then I could put this and then we could use an explanation point because I know there's one of those here somewhere there we go and then I could just make it three lines there you go so see it's not hard to do so I go back in that informational menu I can center my stuff again I can move everything closer together or further apart so we can put that all in there like that. 
We can change directions. We can make it bigger, smaller. There is so much to do. And I think that particular part of this machine is just made it so much easier to use. One of the things I will point out to you that right now, if I had this ready to go and I wanted to see how much space it was gonna take up, I have the wonderful ability. Now I'm gonna tell it which actual hoop I have on here because I have a different hoop on than what's on there. I have just a large oval. Look, there it is, it shows me the hoop. Now what I can do is I can actually find where the center is. There it shows me where that would be. But then what I can do is I can come over here and I can use the check function and then we put on our hoop so that it knows we have it on there. Then what I can do is I can use my laser light to see all this. I can move to the center. If that really is the center, then I can say that. But what I can also do is say, no, I really want it to be moved up a little bit, or I can move it over to this part. And then what I can do is I can check using my laser light. It goes up in the top left-hand corner, and then I can go to the right, can go to the bottom right. All of this now, I can actually see because the laser light gives me a kind of guided area. And if I, it's really important for me to figure out exactly where those things are going, then I can just run that laser light right along there and make sure it's all in the spots I need it to be. The, uh, the ease of using this has got me so excited because in the past I just was scared of I'd put it in the wrong place. I'd, you know, not know what to do. I'd be, you know, if I made a mistake on writing out something, I'd have to go into software and fix it. Well, you don't have to do any of that now. It's gotten so much simpler. And now you have been thinking that maybe you wanted to do some of this stuff, but it just looked daunting. We're in a new ball game now. And I think that this machine is just going to be so much easier and so much more fun. You are going to, instead of putting that embroidery unit aside, you're gonna use it. And you're gonna use it a lot and you're gonna have a lot of fun with it. I know I wanna play with it because not only can I do embroidery with it, but I can also quilt with it. It's a really big deal in a very nice event. It is very nice to go ahead and be able to do all this stuff now. Um, I just think it's gonna be just, it, it really is gonna be a game changer for most of us. All right, everybody, we are just about at that 10 o'clock mark. Don't forget I have that cute little Bernina koozie for you to put your cold drink in for the summer. That is gonna go to the winner of those who share. You can get entered into a drawing. And last week, you guys really surprised us. You guys had 21 people we shared with. Thank you so much, and I hope that we can keep that up. That'd be so cool. Okay, tomorrow, make sure you come and join us for Facebook Live. I have got some new fabric that just came in that is the perfect grandma fabric for, I mean, you know, if you've got some great kids in your life, this fabric is gonna be so much fun. Um, we're gonna show that off to you. Hopefully, I will have a kit ready of the Bernina fabric to show you, and we will hope, I'm hoping to also maybe we'll get a video done of uh, Yaya Han's machine. So we'll see how that all rolls. But don't forget to tell your friends and your, your buddies that so about us. We want everyone to know we ship all over the country. We just had a wonderful experience with a gal in Tennessee who needed some help finding a part for her machine. We got it for her and now it's up and running and she was so happy. And we, we love doing stuff like that for you. So if we can help you, if you're having a problem with your machine, if you're having problems doing something, let us know. Let's see if we can help you. Don't forget, if you're even if you're not around in the Indiana area and you want to buy a Burnett, you can do it that with us online. We're at universityofsewing.com. And if you just have a question, info at universityofsewing.com. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Oh, open sewing. We have some open sewings coming up, so look for those. Have a great day, everybody, and we'll see you tomorrow morning for Facebook Live.